Okay, thank you for clicking on this video. I really appreciate it. I just wanted to make a quick, fun little video because it is Veterans Day. I really appreciate all the veterans. And if you have a story, a comment about your time in the Army or any any branch of the military, let me know because I always found like I did some tracer videos up here catching leaves on fire. And a lot of people left a lot of pretty cool comments about in the army, you know, at the range, shooting a bunch of tracers and catching shit on the fire. So I love stuff like that. Uh, but today, we got a really cool video. Well, it's just a fun little video. <laughs> I've been carrying the 5.7 around for self-protection you know, for a while now. A couple months anyway. I only ever had to shoot a couple people with it. It you know, worked good. I was just kidding, guys. Now, never needed it. Thank God, but uh, I want to see what it does because right here, I got a homemade block, a ten dollar, <laughs> spent a whole ten bucks on that ballistics gel. Uh, it is fucking tough as hell. I mean, that's some good gel for ten bucks compared to like you know over a hundred dollars. Like, obviously it's not clear, but for ten bucks, we're gonna see what the five seven does versus a nine millimeter. So we're gonna start off, she is loaded. So we've got the blue tips, they're both FN ammo. Uh, these are just like a hollow point, like a polymer tip in there. They do expand pretty good. Uh, and then we just got the FN full metal jackets. And then for the nine millimeter, always keep your shit loaded. Uh, we got the Winchester Rangers plus P hollow points. Uh, 124 grain i do believe these are a plus p they're pretty nasty boy they work very good so we're going to just see what the five seven does we'll set it up set the water jug pumpkin behind it and we'll see what it does and then we'll just do nine millimeter just a quick little fun video okay guys i got a blue tip loaded in here and then i'm going to follow it up with a full metal jacket and we'll just see what happens It kind of stopped it. It kind of went through too. All right, let's try a full metal jacket here. Maybe a little bit lower. Okay, that gel worked amazing. That was a blue tip. Uh, so it did go through there and I shot lower and the full metal jack did come out. Oh, and it glazed there. So it did make a full penetration. That's six inches. Stuff is gross though. And that's pretty cool. I mean, it can be better here. Okay, yeah. I don't know if the camera pickup is getting kind of late in the evening. But, I mean, this really worked good. You can see the wound channel there. Came, came out up here. You guys awesome. So, that's pretty impressive. Even for the full metal jacket, you could tell, like, this dumped more energy quicker. But, that's pretty impressive. So, let's just try the 9mm here. All right, super cool result. It did that thing where it came out. There was an exit hole. It hit this composite board I had, spun the bullet around backwards, and that is the hollow point. I probably can dig that out. Oh man, yeah, getting dirty. Look at that. So, you can see, I shot right between the two. Perfect shot. I mean, I was close, but I hate to toot my own horn, but. You can tell, 9 millimeter, more of a power dump. Better, a little bit better. But you can see the 5.7 compared to a plus P 9 millimeter, that's not bad. And this, <laughs> this $10 uh, block of uh, uh, 
gel. I hate to call it gel because, listen, I was completely sober when I made this, okay? Cut me some slack here. But she worked really good. So, if, so yeah, if you think this $10 block of uh, homemade ballistic gel worked pretty good, give it a like because it's a lot cheaper to make it yourself. I'm going to make like a giant fucker. I'm going to shoot with some big fucking guns. So as soon as I get a chance. But yeah. Look at that. Perfect shot right in. Ew. Ew. That's a stinky hole. Definitely smells like wet dog. But yeah, you can see it there at 9mm. Yep. Definitely a little bit more power, but I like the 5.7. Alright, I'm just rambling on, guys. Thanks for watching.